And the House Oversight Committee today is expected to hold a retired IRS official in contempt of Congress. Republicans say Lois Lerner led an effort to investigate Tea Party organizations. She has refused to, refused to testify at two committee hearings claiming her Fifth Amendment rights. Jan Crawford is in Washington where another panel is also taking aim at Lerner. Jan, good morning. Well, good morning. And Lerner really has been refusing for the past year to answer those questions from Congress about the scandal. And yesterday, we saw this House committee really ratchet up the stakes. It voted along straight party lines to ask the Justice Department to consider criminal charges against Lerner for allegedly directing the IRS to target conservative groups. In a letter to the Justice Department, Chairman Dave Camp said the committee had information that Lerner allegedly engaged in willful misconduct and potentially violated multiple federal criminal statutes. Now, the Justice Department said in a statement that it's already investigating the IRS's handling of these tax-exempt groups and that it, quote, remains a high priority of the department. Democrats, of course, are saying that the Republicans on the committee are just playing politics. But adding fuel to the fire here, I mean, this is not all. Yesterday, ethics investigators also reporting that IRS employees at several different offices were actively supporting President Obama while they were on the job, including one employee they reported who was urging people that were calling into this taxpayer helpline to vote for the president. Nora? All right, Jan, thank you.